Hi everyone, this is Yamato Xstar, aka teacher Yamato Prep School teacher, music composer, traveler. So let's get started. Take a walk. ということで始まりました TJ モトです。今回はゴールドコースト郊外にあるカランビンワイルドライフサンクチュアリーの番外編です。まずは野鳥ショーのワイルドスカイズです。午前と午後の1日に2回の開催で観覧は無料です。こちらは午後の部となります。
They could be housing a surprising number of native animals that are all Animals, but like our beautiful master, his name is Gorilla. Now the past hour, this is the largest tiger owl in the world. And this tiger owl is one that's specialised in hearing. That part with dislike shaped face acts as a satellite disc, carrying sound towards her asymmetric ears or her pop side of ears. That's from over 800 metres worth. And once she locates her prey, she airbushes them from above and she'll utilise what is known as silent flight. Her feathers are frayed along the edge, eliminating all sound as she hunts in the still of the darkness of the night. Now, owls like gorilla, they have utilised tree hollows for breeding. However, they have fur if they can't hear their companions call, they will just use their impeccable eyesight. They will use their
bounties were offered for the dead carcasses of wedge-tailed eagles, as they were incorrectly blamed for the killing of livestock such as sheep and cattle. It was estimated that in this time, over one million birds were killed, bringing the wedge-tailed eagle right to the brink of extinction. But I'm happy to tell you all that in 1968,続いて夕方に1日1回だけ開催される原住民ラボリジニのショーです。こちらも観覧は無料です。the next dance a dance about our people going fishing this is about going fishing on one particular fish which is the mullet fish and the mullet is very important to our family here in the gold coast area the mullet fish will migrate from the cold waters in the south to the warmer waters in the north during the cooler months. When we see the paper bark trees just starting to flower, that's the very first sign for our family that the mullet will start to travel through this area. Beers, our nets, our fishing gear, head down to the water and start fishing. In our language for fish, we say chalam.
understands that that's about the boomerangs. In our language, we call the boomerang barakat. The returning boomerangs were used as a decoy or to trick the animals. We also have larger hunting boomerangs or killer boomerangs. Dancer boomerangs, barakat. Ah. didgeridoo solo. Didgeridoo, just a hollow piece of wood and it's hollowed out by the termites or the white ants and it's strictly a men's instrument only to be played and touched by men only. The way we play didgeridoo, we vibrate our lips in a loose relaxed fashion. We also have circular breathing which allows us to play didgeridoo continuously for a long time without stopping. As the Dridu player begins to play, at the very start, I will ask him to raise his hand just to show you or indicate to you when he is taking a breath in through his nose. Did you redo? taught us we always hunt in the middle of the migration of mullet fish never at the front or the back of the school because that's where the leader fish are the boss fish if we start hunting on those leader fish the leader fish will take the rest of school or migration of mullet back out to deeper waters and we miss out on the catch until the school of fish come back into shallow waters again which could be a couple of days or even longer our totem the eagle nip it Hey, 
店内を周回する観光列車カランビンエクスプレスに乗ってメインエントランスへと向かいます。
現在は開始されている路線も見えます。次はバスに乗ってゴールドコーストの中心部サーファーズパラダイスへと向かいます改めまして今回のオーストラリアはこんな感じとなっております<音楽>ではまたお会いしましょうありがとうございましたはい。